Right, the, the devotion to the Sacred Heart of Jesus spread in the Comboni family by getting to know how Comboni was a person in love with Africa. And this love spread through the own reading of St. Daniel Comboni of the devotion of the Sacred Heart that started in France. A nun who received this vision of this loving heart of Jesus in love, but this love was not uh, corresponded. It was not, you know, properly saying, I love you too. So uh, the devotion started spreading like fall in love with the heart of Jesus. But it was a personal love. But in the sense, just knowing like, I'm in love with you, you are in love with me. So Daniel Comboni, by reading this and making it his own devotion, he says, I understand that the heart of Jesus is in love, but not of me alone is in love with the world, especially with the most poor and abandoned. Poor, the people that he was thinking in his mind was Africa. He saw the abandoned people of Africa, not only by the world, by the world powers, but especially by the church. At that time they were considering a uh, stop for the mission. It was so hard, so difficult. The missionaries were dying. It was for the Pope and, and the rest of people in charge of the propaganda feeding. Maybe it's time to pull off. And Komboni says, no, this is the right time because the heart of Jesus also beats strongly for Africa. And this love cannot be just for me and you. It has to be for everybody, especially the people who are condemned to the darkness of different situations. Now, the Komboni missionaries, especially during the time of our novitiate, when we are thinking to become religious and we study all what it implies to be a Komboni missionary, we are given this spirituality. Spirituality is the fuel that feeds your passion. And the passion for the mission today is to go to the more poor and abandoned of society and of the church and the marginalized people. And this is inspired by God's reading and Komboni's reading of his spirituality.